bitch so it's fucking raining um exhibit a that's why i'm wearing this finally painted my nails again on my lunch a very slow day like mentally physically how do you like to start your mornings now i'm going to talk about myself i love having chill mornings because i just feel like i start my day off well if i do so like i need to wake up like an hour and a half or two hours before i need to do my thing and i like to like like lay in bed for a while and then get up and then make my tea eat some fruit journal like write what i'm grateful for and shit and then i like to like bitch look at the weather choose my outfit maybe do mascara maybe not go to the bathroom brush my teeth so just chill today i woke up i set my alarm at six and it rang and I still laid, and I guess I hit snooze, so, you know, it, it rang again, and then I turned it off, and then I had another one at 6.30, heard that, and then I, like, turned it off, and I laid in bed for a while, and then at, like, 7, I was like, oh, bitch, like, I actually need to get the fuck up. Bad idea, because I at least should have just woken up at 6.30, had the hour and a half, or had the hour, and like actually been able to drink my tea and stuff and I didn't get I didn't get to like write what I'm grateful for which is fine because I can do it now on my lunch but I love having a chill morning and I feel like when I don't everything just feels hectic and now I'm eating applesauce but anyway that, that's why I love mornings I love just I love waking up early like y'all know like when your grandma is like hella old clearly grandma and like if she's over at your house or something she like just gets up early and is just watching tv and it's the cutest fucking thing ever like just watching her watch tv like the pov of it so fucking cute that's how i feel all the time and i've just been like that ever since i was a child like i'll wake up at like fucking the ass crack of dawn i don't even know if dawn is like the correct word and i'll be watching tv or that's what i used to do and then now it's like i need to chill and work on myself light a little candle yeah how do you like to start off your morning that's my question of the day or of the day for today while you're probably watching a fucking compilation of me just talking in the car bitch that's that's who i am this is like the realest as it gets it's the way that i've been fucking actually grinding like grinding bitch i've been doing my work and i'm so happy and proud of myself i also don't give a fuck that it's dark you're just gonna have to like get used to it but I am so proud of myself because, okay, today, I finished the video. Was it any of the requirements that he had? No, bitch, I made up my own requirements. But it's like, in my brain, that's okay because at least I did it. So I finished my video and then I just needed to make like an, a magazine um, page. And so I did that too. That was like my work for like today. But yesterday, I finished another final. The day before that, I think I finished like one of my other finals if not like i actually did work so i've just been like grinding and i have to write two more research papers and then that's it and then i'm done with finals and i'm only staying here longer because i have to work until like next week or i don't have to but i i said i wanted to because like bitch i'm gonna be gone for a fucking month let me take my fucking time here before i have to head back home anyway so yeah um i am so happy and proud of myself and I feel like that just deserves me going out, spending some money, or I, I low-key really want sushi. This man lost his car, which is, I mean, mood. I think I'm going to drive to Santana Row and just, like, walk around or something. Anyway, that was my little update. I just wanted to tell you I'm so proud of myself, and I'm so happy, and that's why we're going to go out and eat some sushi. Okay, let me show you. I'm wearing my TV Girl shirt. It's about to be a year since I went to go see them. Anyway, I'm here now. It is beautiful. I'm gonna walk around a little bit. And like there's this bomb ass fucking sushi place like right near here. I just don't know if I want sushi or if I want like something else. So I need to like kind of walk around. Scope out my options. It is quite cold. So there's that problem. But I think for the most part I might just end up getting sushi. We'll see though. I'll keep you updated. I'm so excited. I was just FaceTiming my sister as I was like over here because it's my mom's birthday today. Hashtag queen I was telling her how i finished my um finals she wasn't too excited so i hope that y'all are more excited for me i don't know if you can hear me because i don't know if it's really loud but i just ordered and it's so cute here and i'm so happy and i went shopping before and i got this cute ass mushroom beanie I'm so excited. 
some origami and a little incense holder. So, self-care. Okay, so I just got done eating. It was so good. I just take a really fucking long time eating. So I've been here definitely more than an hour and the parking's only an hour, but that's okay. I'm also so fucking cold. I should have layered more. I wish the sun was out. I need the sun. Mr. Sun, where you at? I am so cold, like so cold. Um, and I could have like been like that bitch to just fucking buy a sweater, but let's be some, let's be a little like money conscious. Anyway, I only spent like $70 and although I only went to two locations, it was like, I'm very much satisfied. I'm becoming very crafts, crafty, crafty. I'm gonna be going back home and like all I'm gonna do is like work and I'm gonna be honest. I don't have a lot of friends back home. So am I the problem? I don't think so. Cause I got friends here. I got friends here, but like, you know, I've become very crafty and i have a lot of like things to make crafts so like so i got classic origami thing and it's like a kit and it has like the paper already so like bitch sign me up i got the fucking cutest fucking beanie i'm so excited for it, it was literally only 20 dollars. that is so good when like beanies like are racked up hella and like at first i was like oh my god that's a lot but then i was like bitch think no that's not and then this is wrapped up but it's like a little it's a little turtle and it's an incense I was just gonna buy it for decoration, but I do have incense. But yeah, I'm so happy. The food was so good. It was my first time ever trying. I love going, like, I've been telling myself that I want to go on dates with myself more often. And having came to Santana Row, like, did you guys see how decorated it is now, too? Like, I'm so excited. This is probably, like, my last time coming. So I just really, I needed to enjoy it. Thank you for joining me. Um, I'll see you whenever I record again. But... Yeah, thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Gemini bitches! The fucking moon! Dude, this looks like literally a fucking... If you could... I wish the fucking phone could capture the moon. She is beautiful. Holy shit. Oh my god, you Gemini bitches are so lucky that you guys get such a beautiful moon. Okay, I'm, I'm getting it. Getting and I am so sorry I'm getting in. Um, oh, I'm about to be that bitch. Oh my god! Wow, wow, wow! I am astonished. I am so just like amazed. That moon, holy shit! Like I didn't think that it would be out already. Like I mean, I know that it's getting dark and it's barely five, but she has risen. She is out. Wow. Let's play Gemini rights just for that.